Good morning, boys and girls, and happy Friday. We have a visitor today. Hey, Word Bird, it's so nice to see you. Word Bird, why aren't you saying anything? You're very quiet today. Oh, I get it, because we're doing the letter Q, and the letter Q is often paired with U that makes the qu qu sound. So you're being very quiet, aren't you, Word Bird? Did you bring us something today, Word Bird? What did you bring? I'm going to guess that there's something in this bag that begins with the letter Q. Hmm, it's very light, and there aren't many things that begin with the letter Q. Oh, I have a, an idea. I wonder if it's a quill that old-fashioned feather pen that they used to use in the olden days. Is it a quill? Well, I give up. I guess I'm gonna have to look. Let's take a look in the bag. Oh, of course. It's a quarter. And even though we say quarter, it also begins with Q and U. So this is worth 25 cents. It's one of our Canadian coins, which we're going to be talking about later this year. And if I turn it around, take a look. That's the queen, qua qua queen. And the queen, who is Queen Elizabeth, is on every one of our Canadian coins. This is an elk, and that's how we know that this is a quarter that is worth 25 cents. However, there are some special edition quarters, and I found some of these in my wallet. This is from the Vancouver 2010 Winter Olympics that took place in Canada. And then we have some of the winter sports. And if we turn it around to the other side, look at that. It's still the queen. And here is another special edition quarter here. Take a look. And then we turn it around. Guess what? You betcha. You got it. It's Queen Elizabeth. Well, boys and girls, I've included some activities that will that you can do to um, study further study the letter Q, and we hope you have a wonderful Friday and a terrific weekend. Bye.